I have a few relatively good news for Red Dead Online, because in today's weekly update few good things happen. First of all, snow is finally gone. And yeah, snow is cool and I enjoyed it when it was added back in December, but you know, just like in real life, snow is cool for a few days. But having snow for a month or more is kinda annoying, because there are a lot of inconveniences, at least it's my point of view. But anyway, now snow is gone in Red Dead Online and I like it. But there is another pretty good thing happening in today's weekly Red Dead Online update. A lot of limited offer clothing was added, was brought back to the game, including my favorite item. Yes, a lot of players were asking me where did I get that hat that I'm wearing on most my outfits, and now you can buy it. Cossack's hat is back, you can even buy it with discount. But you know what's weird? Most of this limited offer clothing is warm, and Rockstar decided to add this to the game when snow is gone, when it's not not cold anymore in Red Dead Online. I have an interesting theory why it happened, but first let me briefly tell you about other bonuses and discounts that I found in today's weekly Red Dead Online update. And yes, usually we received weekly Red Dead Online updates on Tuesdays, and today it's Thursday, it's a day for GTA Online weekly update, but I mean, I don't know why it's happening. So first, discounts can be found at stables for Nokota, Race, Horse, and for all Mustangs and actually it's a great offer for beginners especially because Mustang is a great horse considering the price and with a discount for $350 it's a must have for every beginner. Because yes, difference between horses is not significant but here for extremely small price you're receiving a horse with awesome stats. It has a lot of health which is important and other stats are also pretty well balanced. Next discount is on all hats, I've already mentioned this one. And another discount discounts that I found is on all fresh foods. It's kinda weird one to be honest. Anyway, massive extra payouts that we had in Red Dead Online for almost a month are gone now. I'm talking about double payouts for trader role, for moonshiner role, for bounty hunter role and so on. But there are double money and experience for featured series and by the way hardcore series are back, it's always good especially for new players. And the most importantly there are double money and gold for story missions. Actually I haven't found any other bonuses or discounts so far, maybe there is something else, we will find out about it only at the evening from the newswire post, if there will be newswire post obviously, but if there will be something important I will let you know. And now let's talk about limited offer closing. So we have two hats, Cossack's hat and Fan's stovepipe hat, Irving coat which looks pretty cool in my opinion, tight pants, Salter shoes and also we have darned stockings and furried gloves. And I mean it would make sense for them to add all this clothing during this big holiday event. It was not big in terms of content, it just lasts for almost a month. They should have added all this warm clothing when it was cold weather in Red Dead Online, when there was a snow. All these stockings for example is definitely an item that you want to add in Red Dead Online during Christmas holidays. Or let's say Cossack's hat. Most attackers in holiday call to arms mode, which is gone now by the way. Anyway, most attackers uh, were wearing this exact hat and it was not added into the game, people could not buy it. And by the way, we had no limited offer clothing during this big monthly event in Red Dead Online, which also makes no sense at all. So I think, I'm pretty sure that Rockstar initially planned to add all this clothing month ago on 7th of December, but they simply forgot to do it, someone didn't press the button, and when they realized this mistake, they were like, oh, what a shame, but whatever, who cares about Red Dead Online anyways. So Rockstar either decided to add a lot of warm limited offer clothing when snow is over, which is definitely a brilliant idea, or they simply forgot to do one small thing and add this clothing one month ago. And in both cases it's such a typical rockstar classic. Anyway guys, I hope there will be some additional information in the news why and now please let me know what do you think about today's weekly Red Dead Online update in the comments. And as always I hope you enjoyed this video, thank you for watching, like, subscribe, до свидания.